Now to this. A Smithville High School coach who is also an English teacher is on paid leave tonight after several students claim he made a racially insensitive comment in class. This happened Thursday morning right before a Black History Month program. The Night Beats' Shelton Green spoke to parents of three of those students in that class who heard the comment. It's business as usual at Smithville High School Friday, but missing is a teacher the district refuses to name. What we do know is he's a coach and has been at the school for almost two years. My family is very dedicated and committed to this community. We love the people of this town. We love the small town, but I'm outraged that something like this can be done in a classroom setting. And the coach consider it a joke. Alicia Elam says she got a text from her son, a senior star athlete and honor roll student at Smithville High. My son texted me at 11:30 during his period class in English, and he said to me, he texted me and said, something really bad had just happened, and you're probably going to need to get here. Before noon, black students in an English class were excused to help in a Black History Month program. After they left, a white student asked if he could also participate in the program. His aunt didn't want to show her face. My nephew goes, well, I have a black person in my family, and the teacher's response was, is he hanging from a tree in your front yard? And then he realized that there was a black child in the class. That child was Elam's son. He was saying, I have black kids in my family. How come I can't get excused from class to go help with the black history program too? And the coach uh, replied to him, are they hanging in trees in your front yard? The superintendent says several white students also complained about the teacher's alleged comments. But what bothered me the most is my son said to me, Mom, we should be used to this by now. And that was heartbreaking because I don't feel like we should ever get used to racism or prejudice or discrimination. That was the night beat Shelton Green. Now, the Smithville superintendent told KBU he wants to move quickly on this investigation because he says he thinks it's important. He expects to have an outcome to this investigation on Monday.